Namaste, all dear friends. This presentation is done by Professor Pralhad Bhatri, and today we are going to discuss the new chapter, Various Types of Fuels Used in the Kitchen. In this chapter, we are going to discuss about various types of fuels used in kitchen, which include solid fuels, like wood, charcoal, liquid fuels like LPG, CNG, kerosene, petrol and diesel, gaseous fuels like biogas and steam and various other fuels, with its advantages and disadvantages. Heat is a source of energy, which is obtained by combustion of the fuel. This heat is then transferred, and utilized to cook the food. Fuels are the sources for heat to be generated. In order to cook the food in the kitchen, this heat need to be obtained, and for this fuel is important. This is essential for a chef, to understand and study, the heat sources with their characteristics. Classification of fuel Fuel is classified into five parts. Solid fuel, liquid fuel, gases fuel, electricity, and natural resources. Let us see the examples. There are various types of fuels, used in the kitchen to operate equipment, to aid in the cooking. Fuels are classified as solid fuels like, wood, charcoal and coal. Liquid fuels like, LPG, CNG, petrol, diesel, kerosene. Gases fuel like, biogas and steam, electricity and natural resources like solar, wind etc. Solid fuels. Under the solid fuels, first one is wood. Wood is the essential fuel, used since ancient time. The primitive man started using wood, to cook his food, and nowadays it is used in hotel industry. Wood is used as a fuel for, wood-fired pizza ovens. This gives a smoky flavor to the food, and therefore, wood-fired pizza ovens are most commonly used in a modern restaurants. Let us discuss the advantages. 1. Wood is the most economical fuel. 2. It is very cheap, and 3. It is very easily available. 4. The most common reason of using wood in a hotel kitchen is, it impart a distinctive flavor to the food. Next is disadvantages. 1. While burning wood, it produces lot of smoke, which causes air pollution. 2. It require a storage place, usually it is stored in a sacks, and need space to store them properly. 3. Wood takes lot of time to ignite, sometimes need other things like paper, cardboard or dry leaves, to ignite. 4. It is little difficult to control the temperature, due to its intense heat. 5. Wood is not suitable for, all kind of cooking. Example brat pan, deep fat fryer etc. Wood charcoal. Charcoal is black porous residue of burnt wood. Traditionally charcoal was the fuel, used most often for grilling, and was considered to be best in the flavor. Coal is used in kitchen to light tandoor, grills for barbecue. Charcoal still very popular fuel, due to its smoky flavor. The coal used in the hotel kitchen is wood charcoal only. Let us discuss the advantages of wood charcoal. First it is most economical. Second it is very easily available. Third it impart a distinctive flavor, and that's why, it is most commonly used in, tandoor and barbecue. Fourth no questions of shortage. Next is disadvantages of wood charcoal. First, when we burn wood charcoal, due to its smoke, it pollute air. Second, coal require a storage place, which need to be stored properly in sex. Third, due to its intense heat, the flames cannot be controlled. Fourth, it takes little longer time to ignite, and require some air to ignite. Fifth, it is hygroscopic, it absorb air, so keep away from water. Next is liquid fuels. Under liquid fuels first is LPG, known as liquefied petroleum gas. It is the most essential and commonly used fuel, in any catering kitchens. And it is known for its efficiency. Basically it is a compound of 92% of propane and butane and ethane. It is almost smokeless, and easy to handle. Tormaldehyde is the substance, which is used in LPG, for detection of any gas leakage. LPG is available in various shapes and sizes. In hotel, 
it is supplied through pipelines, and also it require a separate storeroom, for storing gas cylinders, called as gas bank. It should be at least 50 meter away, from the hotel premises. For any catering establishment, it is mandatory, to follow all government rules and regulation. LPG gas is used in kitchen for, gas ranges, ovens, brat pans, rice boilers, grillers, griddles etc. Advantages of LPG fuel First, it cooks food more faster. Variety of burner sizes, are available in market. Second, it is very convenient to use, anyone can operate gas. Third, it is labor saving, and easily available. Fourth, LPG doesn't create any smoke, so no air pollution. Fifth, heat can be easily controlled, with the help of gas knobs. Sixth, no any special utensils are required, to cook the food. Next is disadvantages of LPG gas. First, the cost of gas is quite expensive. Second, LPG is highly combustible, so proper care and precautions need to be taken care. Third, some heat may be lost in the kitchen, side heat may waste while cooking food. Fourth, frequent maintenance and regular cleaning is necessary, to keep it safe and long-lasting. Fifth, it required storage place, gas ranges, gas cylinder, pipelines etc. Sixth, if there is a shortage in the market, that may hamper onto the business, and last, the installation cost is higher, it involve pipes, valves manifold, regulator etc. CNG CNG is compressed natural gas, which is getting popularity for its fuel efficiency, and environment friendly properties. It is mostly used in, eco friendly hotels. It is used as a fuel in, many types of equipments such as, oven, gas ranges, brat pan, rice boilers etc. The advantages of CNG First it is very economical. The cost of CNG is less, as compared to LPG. Second it is fuel efficient. The gas lasts for longer time. Third it doesn't produces, any kind of smoke, so, there is no air pollution, thus it is environment friendly. The disadvantages of CNG gas. First it is not so widely used, in all hotels. Second there may be a shortage of supply, in the market, due to unavailability of CNG. Biogas The biogas production is growing steadily, as more people are setting up biogas plant, to produce a biogas. Biogas is a natural fuel, obtained by fermentation of the animal, human waste, or the garbage. The advantages of biogas Biogas is eco-friendly and renewable. The raw material, used in the production of biogas, is renewable, as trees and crops will, continue to grow, manure, food scraps, and crop residue, are raw materials, that will always be available, which makes it highly sustainable. Second, biogas generation reduces, soil and water pollution. Overflowing landfills don't only spread foul smell, they also, allow toxic liquids, to drain into underground water sources, Biogas generation may improve water quality. Third, biogas generation produces organic fertilizers. The byproducts of the biogas generation process is enriched organic matter, which is a perfect supplement for chemical fertilizers. Fourth, it is economical. The technology used to produce biogas is quite cheap. It is easy to set up and require little investment. The disadvantages of biogas First Very few technological advancement, in production of biogas. The system used in the production of biogas are, not efficient to meet large population due to unwilling of government sector. Second It contain impurities. After refinement and compression, biogas still contain impurities. Third Biogas generation is affected by the weather. Optimal temperature required is 37 degrees centigrade, which is not possible, during all seasons. Fourth. Less suitable for dense metropolitan areas. Due to non-availability of raw ingredients.
Steam. Steaming is a cooking food with the help of steam. Most hotel produces steam, which is used to cook or operate equipment. Steam is supplied to the kitchen, through insulated pipes, and it is used in the equipment, such as steamers, dishwashers, steam jacket kettles etc. The advantages of steam are First It does not pollute air Second The food cooked by steam, is more faster, as compared to other cooking methods. The disadvantages of steam are It requires special equipment to cook the food, like steamers. Electricity Electricity is most commonly used fuel in all kitchens. It is popular due to, its easy operation and controlled temperature, as per the requirement. Electricity cannot be seen, heard, tested or smell, but electricity can cause serious injury, if proper care is not taken. Care should be taken, while ordering electrical equipment, as many countries, operate on certain volt. In India, electric equipment operate at 220 volts, and, in USA, it works at 110 volts. Also, care should be taken, when installing equipments. Many heavy electrical equipments like, ovens, deep freezers, bain-marie, refrigerator etc., required three-phase supply, and, fewer equipments required a single-phase supply. Advantages of Electricity First. It is easily available. Second. It cook the food faster, as different temperature settings are available, in kitchen equipments. Third. It does not pollute environment, it is not causing any smoke. Fourth. The temperature can be controlled easily, with help of knobs. Fifth. Very little loss of heat in the kitchen. Six. It is labor saving. 8. It does not require any storage place, like wood, charcoal, LPG etc. Next is disadvantages of electricity. First, chances of electric hazards, like leakage, fire, if it is not handled properly. Second, skilled labors are required, to use few modern equipments, like combi ovens, deck ovens, mincer, bone saw machine, planetary mixer etc. Third, the installation and maintenance cost is higher. Certain equipments require proper installation and annual maintenance and servicing, to increase its shelf life, like ovens, refrigerators, induction hubs, deep freezer, walk-in coolers etc. Fourth, special utensils are required to cook the food, like induction pans, trays, silicon mats and mold, pans etc. Natural Resources under natural resources, first is, solar energy. It is obtained from, the rays of the sun, which is used to produce energy. Solar energy, as a fuel, it is not so much commonly used in hotels, but many eco-friendly hotels, have solar cookers, that are used for cooking, but it is little time consuming, as it take lot of time to cook the food. The advantage of solar is, it is eco-friendly, does not pollute air, economical and easily available source of fuel. The disadvantages are, special equipment is required and it is time consuming. Other fuels used in hotel are, solid fuel. Solid fuel is, made from petroleum jelly, and comes in small tins or available in big cans. Generally, it is, used in F&B service area, hardly used in the kitchen, it is most commonly used in the banquets as a fuel for chefing dishes.